first lookbook, let's get into it. This one is a classic. You can't really think of Three Cheers for Street Revenge without thinking about this outfit. You see this a lot in the music videos and everything, and when they perform, especially on Gerard. Got these little socks there to match the theme. Nothing says have to get the souls of a thousand evil men for my lover like a red necktie and a black blazer. Can't argue with that. It's just me posing because I can't get out of the house. So I hope you enjoy more of my face because you're going to see a lot of it. Not gonna lie, I just feel really cool in like a belt like this and like trousers, like... One of many random clips you're gonna see. Chai Chai. <laughs> Imagine if it went like... Sorry, Bambi's playing. Pharrell Williams. This is a casual look I put together. And fun fact, I wore a look like this on my 18th birthday. It's basically a hybrid of Frank and Mikey's after show looks. When they're just chilling. You know, the brass knuckle pendant. A tight shirt that's mostly black and some ripped jeans, some blue denim, a hat, some obnoxious belt, and yeah, beat up Converse. Think Warp Tour vibes around 2004. It's 2004. And I'm about to go to Hot Topic and get a new set of fake eyeballs because um, I left mine at home. These are just a friend, so I'm sorry if they look a little scared. Guess I'm just waiting to you. <laughs> so, you can't see my face, but yeah, we're done shooting the boy part, boy in the Uh, yeah, the mask, the mask looks. And tomorrow we're gonna shoot the fan looks. And yeah, I need a shower. Uh, and. Both of the dogs are here. Good. Hope you enjoy. And do a little dance for you. So this is my take on what the girl on the cover of the album would be wearing. Platform Mary Janes with lacy socks, a frilly lacy top, and a harness. You can see she's waiting to see her lover again. You know, she's in pain, she's praying. You got that vibe with the rings and everything. She's coming down the stairs, gonna stare at you. Very conveniently placed, creepy ass painting on the wall. Makes for very good background. So, you know, I'll take it. Definitely one of my favorite looks, especially the demonia shoes and the harness. Shout out. Shout out to Antonio. What? Antonio the cockroach, you winky nila. Stop. You. Hello. Stop. Get up. I'm gonna go back and get up. And beautiful. Out. Boing. So, uh, 
my sister was playing a Rex OC song at this point, but you know, I don't want to get copyright claimed, so. Fresh baby. Little boopy nose. Boop. For the last look, this is if Helena were a modern scene queen. I added that choker detail. It looks like a bat and a heart. The red belt and the red fishnets go together with the red clip. Some handcuff earrings. The pentacle necklace. Black shorts, black crop top. With the black Doc Martens. And the black sheer dress. Really just goes together. Really one of my favorite outfits. And that's me just being a goof. I really enjoy mixing textures. And for this outfit, it always looks good. And a uh, random question, but what's your favorite MCR revenge song? Mine is, it's not a fashion statement, it's a death wish. And for these next few shots, I'm basically just showing off more of the details that you can't see. Forgot to mention that very obvious black cuff hand wrist things that I forgot the name of. And you know... Just more creepy, weird paintings in the back. Me angrily staring, stepping on a crate. Including this extra footage just to show off anything that wasn't clear in the video that we took outside. This boat. The shorts, this thing, socks. As you can see, I have not yet unpacked my school bag. <laughs> so it's really gonna be in the background there. <laughs> okay, let me talk about why I chose Three Cheers of Sweet Revenge as my first lookbook theme. It's because it is my favorite My Chemical Romance album and I just love Red and Black so much. There's a lot I want to say about it, but I might get too emotional and cry or something, so yeah, let's just leave it at that. I love this album a lot. It means a whole lot to me. I identify with it a lot and it's been in my life for a while now. So. You know, if you have time, listen to the album, it's really good. If you like, you know, heavier stuff. Yeah. So, I don't know if you guys can hear me well, but I really wanted to show you, like, I don't know if I'm aware that the lookbook is so badly lit. Wait. Look how cool this thing is. Ooh, snatch. Okay, um, anyways. I really wish you could see this in real life. It looks so much cooler. Um, I'm aware that this lookbook is not the best. And it's not well lit. It's not professional either. But for now, it's the best I can do. It's not completely horrible, I guess, but I just tried to have some fun with it, not take myself too seriously since I know it's not going to be the most polished thing in the world. So I hope you enjoyed it regardless. Let me know what your favorite look was. And yeah, if you have any suggestions for any videos or anything, please leave it in the comments. Check the description box for all the links to everything. To my Instagram for the pre-save and follow link to my Spotify for my Bandcamp and SoundCloud and something I forgot. So yeah, I hope you all are having a great day and I don't have the most polished makeup look but I really love the 3D clown thing I've got going on here and this little weird brushed ends. Okay. Yeah. Follow my sister on Instagram, she helped me film this. For once, you guys didn't have to sit through 
15 to 17 minutes of me talking. So, hope you guys are happy about that. And yeah, hopefully more lookbooks to soon. The, what? M more lookbooks to come soon that will not be filmed in a dark hallway. So yeah, see you guys. And like, turn on the notification bell, subscribe and everything. And I hope you enjoy. Real quick before the video ends, I just want to plug the account of one of my best friends. She's selling really good art for reasonable prices that are negotiable too. And it would really mean a lot to her and it would mean a lot to me too if you just gave her a follow or told your friends. So let's support artists and yeah, take care everyone. That's it for this week guys. Stay hydrated and stay swagalicious, am I right? <laughs> Kill me. <laughs>